Well, this winter just seems to be going on and on, but despite the snow and sub freezing temperatures outside, area swimmers have been in their bathing suits on a daily basis. And Shawnee senior Emily Murphy is one of those people who has spent this long winter in the water. But don't get too jealous. There's no relaxing, no relaxing, definitely no beach, definitely no tanning going on. As I found out in tonight's OIO prep profile, it's all training and hard work. That's Shawnee senior Emily Murphy effortlessly gliding to another first place finish. As her final high school swim season nears its end, Emily is focused on one thing. I'm so excited for my last state meet. I think it's going to be a great experience and great time. Um, myself along with my team have been working really hard this year, so we're hoping that everything's going to pay off at that meet. It's crazy at the state meet. Uh, it's it's jam-packed, crowded with fans and with swimmers, and it's it's loud and the adrenaline's pumping. So, I mean, it's it's intense. That's the perfect atmosphere for Emily to thrive. And her favorite event, the 50 meter freestyle, is her main objective. I just need to put everything, my heart and soul into that event at stake. It's just such a quick event that, you know, you just, you can't mess up on anything. So every time I'm in the pool practicing, I have to think about the little stuff. So then when it comes to that race, I know what to do and I don't even have to think about it. She's gotten second the last two years. So we're hoping uh, the 50 is going to be a win this year. Murphy won both the 50 and 100 freestyle at this year's WBL meet, and she's currently seated first in the 50 free for districts. She has a great start and a great turn, and when you're a sprinter, those are the two most important things in her race, and uh, that's what sets her apart from the rest of the field for sure. I'm competitive, so I want to win, but more than anything, I just want to see myself improve and see my time drop. Despite having so much success, swimming wasn't love at first sight for Emily. You know, at the start of it, when I was a little kid, it wasn't my favorite thing to do. Um, but as I grew up, I just learned to love the team and love the sport, and it's been great ever since. Sticking with it definitely was the right move. Once she finishes up at Shawnee, Emily will attend the University of Pittsburgh to continue her swimming career. I feel a little nervous and a little excited about it. Um, I picked Pitt because of the people and I felt really comfortable with the coaches and the team and they were all just so welcoming and nice. I felt like it'd be a great fit for me. I talked to the Pitt coach uh, back before she signed and I think what people don't know about Emily is she's real versatile. She can swim anything well and uh, Pitt's really looking forward to using her as a sprinter. She's a hard worker and I'm sure they'll love her. In Shawnee, I'm Matt Finkel with the Sports Report.